look a mess, I know, um, but I just got in from the barn and we have the surprise of a lifetime out there. It's amazing. Um, I'm sure you, it, it's not too hard to guess what happened, but oh my gosh, I'm excited and I'm nervous and I feel like a new mom that read every single parenting book and then got, had the baby and the mind went blank and they're like, what do I do? It's a baby. I don't know what to do. Oh my gosh. Ah, that's what I feel like because I thought I had months to plan or well at least a few more weeks. In fact yesterday I posted because Mabel, okay I didn't actually say that. Mabel had her calf. Oh my gosh. That's how that's how crazy my mind is right now. But um La yesterday, what was I saying? Yesterday I posted that um, on a um, farm site, keeping a fa uh, family cow site, um, because I noticed Mabel was changing. Her um, udder seemed to be filling every morning and every night. I'm out there like petting her and you know desensitizing her, getting her ready for hand milking, and I could tell she was changing. And then she had a lot of discharge and. Um, her lady bits were getting swollen and I was like, mm, something's changing, but everyone said, and I took pictures cause when you're on a farm, you take pictures like that and they're all over farm groups. So if you wouldn't want to see stuff like that, don't join a farm group. But, <laughs> um, I took pictures and everyone's like, oh, she's got five, she's got weeks, weeks and weeks and weeks. She's good. She's just getting ready. So I was like, okay, I knew something was changing and I just assumed she was just, her body's prepping. Yeah, and then last night with chores, she had a lot of discharge, and my head said, that looks like maybe her mucus plug, but I've had three kids, and I know a mucus plug can, like, come out. <laughs> this is so gross, and sorry for all of you that are, think this is gross. It's not really gross. It's life. It's, anyways, a mucus plug can come out, um, like, constantly. I mean, it, for, like, weeks before having a baby, so that's what I thought. I'm like, oh, well, you know, it happens. And, well, she apparently doesn't give much sign before, um, before giving birth. So I was, I was right. But yeah, now my, my head's like, oh my gosh, funny story. We were going to go shopping, like literally this weekend for calving supplies. Because, you know, we had to be ready for when she was ready to calve. Well, guess what? She didn't need any help. I'm a little sad that I missed it. I am, um, I'll admit, but sorry, my dad called. But um, yeah, I'm a little sad that I missed it, but that's okay. Uh, I'm more ecstatic that everything went good because of course, like when you're on like calving groups and farm groups, people ask questions when things go wrong. So I'll, you, you see a lot of this happened and what do I do now? And so I was like, oh my gosh, what's gonna go wrong? And I, I'm so new to this and I don't know what I'm doing. But she's good. He's good. They're good. Um, so yeah, tonight I think I'm gonna be milking. That's the thing. Our stanchion's not done. So it'll be interesting. But she's letting me buy him. Um, she's very cautious, but she trusts me. So um, she wants to kill the dog. So I gotta make sure the dog stays out. But um, I think she did let me milk her a little bit. Um, so that was really good, just to get milk flowing and hopefully get the scent. So, because I'm not sure that he's uh, suckled yet, but oh my gosh, my head's my heart's racing. Anyways, you guys want to see this baby? So here you go, everyone. I'm uh, a little bit winded, but uh, for good reason. We had a, a huge, like, monstrous, monumental surprise when I went to do chores this morning. Uh, hey guys, so. Um, this happened. <laughs> um, we have a calf. Oops, sorry. I went out to do chores this morning and Mabel, oh my goodness, I'm shaking. Mabel, um, was in the barn and she kept looking back and I just had a feeling that something was going on and so I went and looked in all the stalls and sure enough, look what we have. <gasps> oh my goodness. I'm just... For one, I'm floored and I'm in shock because she was not due till April, possibly March. Well, it's, um, yeah, it's a little earlier than I expected. I have nothing. Like, 
this is hay as bedding because we were getting the bedding bailed this weekend. And um, so she's getting lots of hay, which she needs anyways. But uh, so we have a little bull, which yeah, of course we wanted a heifer, but I'm just so thrilled that they're healthy. She is a wonderful mom. She's letting me near him. Like she, of course, she's a typical cow. She doesn't, you know, she, she gets a little antsy when I'm near him, but she's not, clearly not mad at me that I'm right here. Oh my goodness, guys. I, this, this means I'm going to be milking like, uh, today. <laughs> oh my goodness. We don't even have the stanchion done. So, well, I'm, I'm. I don't even have words. I'm just so excited and happy that he's here and healthy and she did a wonderful job and she's a great mom and oh, so, oh my goodness, oh my goodness, we have a baby and everything went good. And this weekend, hilariously, we were going to go shop for supplies for calving. Well, <laughs> we didn't need anything, thank heavens, and he's healthy and um, I've got some molasses water here. It looks really gross. And yeah, that was the only bucket I could find that was big enough. But um, that's going to help her um, with her sugar levels just to keep them up after calving. But she doesn't even care right now. She just wants to eat her hay. Um, she even has a whole bunch of grain over here in the stanchion, the half-built stanchion. And she just wants to eat her hay. So I'm glad because this is the warm spot here. Of course, he follows mom around. So... Oh my goodness, y'all. So be prepared for a bunch of posts and updates. Um, I'm pretty sure he was born this morning uh, by the looks of everything. I think he's, you know, a few, I mean, he's a few hours old. Obviously, he's dry and he's upstanding and he's so sweet. Like, he ran up to me. It was the cutest thing. But um, I haven't seen him, him nurse yet, so... I'm going to have to keep an eye on that. I'm going to probably have to call my dad to come help me today because I have daycare kids. So, Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. He's a little red calf. So, so cute. He's adorable. He still has blood around his nose even from calving. So that's why I know he's, he's pretty fresh. But <sighs> So the fun begins. Oh my goodness. Eek. Be prepared. There's going to be lots of updates on this little one. And now we're going to have to name him. Oh, yay. Good job, Mabel. You're good mama. Don't forget to hit that like button and subscribe to see all the new updates that are going to be happening on Mabel and the new calf and this whole hand milking thing and everything going on on the homestead. Yes, you are a loud one. Yeah. Come on. Come over by mama.